Covering news that matters in Bartlesville, city leaders say it's not a matter of if, but when the city will have to up its water restrictions. Fox 23 Scott Martin talked with the water utilities director about the emergency plans the city is looking into. Raindrops in Bartlesville this week are a welcome sight. It raised the lake about a tenth of a foot, so uh, anything certainly is better than nothing, so we'll We'll take what we can get and just uh, hope for some more. But it's not enough to soak up the severe drought wreaking havoc on the city. It's probably not going to be this the um, the gully washer that will refill the lake, but uh, it, it certainly will help just a little bit. Water Utilities Director Terry Lauritsen says parts of the Hula Lake area saw nearly three inches of rain in the last three days. It, along with the other lakes supplying city water, are still way down. Hula is at 47 percent. Copan, I think, is around 56 percent. We do have a city on lake, which is Hudson Lake, that's at 65 percent. The city's water supply is hovering close to 58%. Talks of emergency water supply are happening in case the drought continues. The city could need emergency water as early as next year. That possibly uh, raw water, so there's some lakes like Birch Lake, Sky Took Lake has raw water available. Uh, within it. Both of those are owned by the Corps of Engineers. Lauritsen says they've been looking at water supply options for years. Other ideas being considered include purchasing treated sure. water from bigger cities like Tulsa. And at what point is it so critical that you've got to have that emergency contingency plan? Um, you know, that's that's just the, I think right now we're, we, we haven't set a point as far as we've got to act now. I think we're uh, getting the plan together as far as some options for us to consider. Everywhere you go in Bartlesville, where you expect to see places full of water like pools and splash pads or bone dry, just like this wishing well fountain area in downtown Bartlesville. There are water restrictions. They're currently at a stage three. The city says with the rainfall expected over the next couple of days, they expect to stay at a stage three until September when they could potentially move that up to a stage four. Reporting in Bartlesville, covering news that matters. I'm Scott Martin, Fox 23 News.